everybody. I'm Ashley Skeba, and it's time for another installment of Just Show Me on Tekka TV, where we take your tech toys and gadgets and show you how to get the most out of them. Today, I'm gonna to show you how to set up a wireless printer on your Windows 7 PC. Now, why would you want a wireless printer? Well, because nobody likes cables, really, and if you can print wirelessly, I can actually use this laptop to print something all the way across my house or my office. So wireless printing is definitely the way to go. So let's take a look and get started. Now you'll have to make sure that your printer is actually compatible with wireless printing. So you can do that by checking the documentation that came with your printer, or sometimes the packaging will have that information on the outside. So from the desktop in Windows 7, we are actually going to click the start menu and we're going to go to devices and printers. So once we open device and printers, we'll see any printers we've already set up as well as our device, which is the Tekka HP here. Uh, we want to add a printer. So let's go to add a printer. It's a button at the top and it will actually start an add printer wizard, which will walk you through the steps required to set up your wireless printer. So you can see the very first thing it asks us is what kind of printer do you want to install? Well, we want to add a network, wireless, or Bluetooth printer. So we're going to click on that and it will search for available printers and it will give me a list of all the printers that it sees on the network. Now with our printer, we have our main printer here at Tekka is our Phaser, Xerox Phaser. And so I'm gonna choose that and I can actually click on next and it says Windows is communicating with the printer and will automatically detect the printer driver to use. A Windows 7 comes pre-installed with a lot of different printer drivers. So in many, many scenarios, you won't actually have to install printer drivers. We can give our printer a name. So I'm going to call it Tekka. Then we're going to click on next and it will install the printer for us. It's fantastic and easy to use. It'll ask us about sharing. Allow that to be shared. That's fine. So other people can use it and you can set it as a default printer if you would like, which usually in your household, you'll probably only have one printer. So you can set that as the default printer. And if you'd like to print a test page, you can do that right here on the last page of the Add a Printer Wizard. We're gonna click on Finish. And that's it. You can see in our Printers and Faxes list in Devices and Printers, our Tekka printer has been added and there's a big green check mark next to it, meaning we have a printer. It is ready, phaser set to print. We are ready to print wirelessly. No more fussing around with cables. That's been Just Show Me on Tekka TV. Be sure to check out Tekka.com for all of our other content, and we'll see you next time.